an answer. Emily Murray going very public after the Uber driver charged with raping her was allowed to leave court, posting bail and given 24 hours to surrender his passport. I want to put a face with this. I want to let wherever the error happened, I want them to see that they hurt someone. Murray says she called an Uber after a night out in Quincy. Frederick Amphel, an illegal immigrant from Ghana, was supposed to drop her off in Weymouth. Well, they say, you know, don't drink. Don't drive. You think you're doing the right thing by, you know, using an Uber. Under a court ruling last year, in Massachusetts, illegal immigrants accused of a crime cannot be transferred to immigration officials. As far as I understand, there was a clerical error. Police claim an immigration detainer was forwarded to Quincy District Court, but the court reports having no record of it at the time of Amfo's arraignment. The DA says his immigration status did not come up in court. The day after his release, Amfo got on a flight back home. They encourage people to step up. You step up and then it's just like, oh, system failed, sorry, next time we'll get them. And while justice has eluded her, Emily Murray's courage has forced change. The trial court says from now on, defendants who are ordered to surrender their passports will have to do so when they post bail and prior to their release.